three, two, one. <laughs> Hey there fans, welcome. We're going old school, classic, unstuffing. Today on Stuffy Unstuffed. I'm your host as always, Paul S. Stuffy Esquire. So kind of just want to give you an update of what I've been doing. Uh, this mystery unboxing is awesome. It's from a fan. Uh, I often talk about him, the transitioning cowboy. And uh, I love it. He addressed it to Paul Stuffy. And uh, if you haven't caught on by now, Paul Stuffy is a stage name. Uh, Jay Goobles often breaks the fourth wall uh, about that on some of our co-videos. Uh, I've, you know, accidentally called him by his real name as well. So it's kind of just a funny uh, joke. Uh, I went old school. I put the, uh, for cleanliness purposes, put it on a silver tray. Uh, I don't know if I've shown this cigar box before. Uh, it's kind of cool. Acid cigars. I actually didn't like the label on the very front. Because the wood is actually beautiful, so I started to try to clean off the wood there. But it's a very deep uh, cigar box, so pretty cool. Dovetailed hinges in the back, really like that. I've uh, been into movies a lot lately, so I watched the new Guy Ritchie film, The Gentleman, uh, starring Matthew McConaughey. And then, of course, I went to some of his classics that got me hooked on Guy Ritchie movies. Guy Ritchie's a great director. He was married to, the, uh, to Madonna. Uh, so Lock, Stock, and Two Smoking Barrels, uh, Snatch, one of his other ones. Uh, this has Brad Pitt in it. Both of them have Jason Statham in it. Excellent. And then again, I just watched the new one, The Gentleman, uh, on iTunes. Um, I'm still working, but I'm working a lot less. I mean, this economy's crazy. Who knows what's going to happen? But I've been uh, learning to play guitar, thanks to YouTube. Uh, you know, I've been watching Marty uh, Music on YouTube. I've also, uh, Fender gave me some online videos with the guitar uh, trial to their service. So, without further ado, oh my gosh, I'm so rusty, forgot to do the wristwatch check. That's right, the Yamaha. Still loving it. 41 millimeter heritage re release of the Superman Dome Sapphire Crystal Date Complication Super Luminova. 300 meter water resistance, stainless steel. I've got it on the Yema brand dive bezel, or dive bezel, yes, it has a dive bezel, but on the dive strap, because I don't have a way to size the bracelet right now. I've also been walking to the lake, doing uh, some wristwatch checks by the lake with the dive watch, been trying to catch the sunset. But uh, yeah, so the cowboy sent me this, I, yeah, I'm really excited. I don't know what's in it. This is the first time I've done an unboxing where I didn't know what was in the packaging. So you guys are going to be surprised right along with me. It's kind of a really cool way to do it. Okay, so the official stuffy. Oh, look at this. It's heavy, whatever it is. Okay, what do we got here? Okay, hmm, what do we got? Dude, awesome box. Huh, okay, I think it's uh, some sort of sanding stone. Maybe it's for sharpening knives? That's so awesome, I'll have to call and ask them. So yeah, 1,000 and 4,000, I, I imagine it's a stone maybe to sharpen knives, which of course, uh, Stuff that you could definitely use as he's into knives. Yeah, for the kitchen, Weststone. Yeah, it's a knife sharpener, I believe. So that is so awesome. Uh, it's got two different ratings. So I keep my kitchen knives super sharp. And I can't wait to get back in the kitchen. I'm staying out of it just because, uh, you know, I am working. And I am exposed to people. So I'm staying out of the kitchen. But I want to get back into doing some kitchen episodes uh, I'm going to be featuring a, a special guest, Q Diggity, uh, in the kitchen with Q Diggity. He's uh, an unknown uh, to you guys, but a longtime fan and friend. And also, uh, he wants to get in on the next top five. So uh, you guys will get a chance to meet Q Diggity. 
before we go uh, into the kitchen when we can get back to it. So that is awesome. Thanks, cowboy. Can't wait to try that out. Sharpening my kitchen knives. That is so awesome. Uh, probably going to be watching some more movies today. Maybe the Born uh, trilogy. Or actually, what are they up to? Four or five now? Because they did the one without Jason Bourne, then went back to Jason Bourne. So I'm going to at least do the original three. And that's uh, what I got lined up today. You know, cut the grass. Just living the dream in quarantine. Peace out, YouTube. Stay safe.